NFC tags are great for changing your phone settings or for setting a timer for your fried egg. But did you know that you can actually use NFC tags to switch on your PC? This may sound complicated to do, but it's actually pretty simple. There are a few apps that you'll need to get on your phone for all this to work. And as always, all the links will be down below in the description box. So let's get started. First things first, go to the Play Store and pick up all the apps. Tasker is a little pricey by mobile app standards, but believe me, once you learn the app, it is pretty great. For this to work, we need to connect your desktop or laptop to the internet via Ethernet, as this trick will not work over a Wi-Fi connection. Now boot on your computer or restart it if it is already on. While your computer is booting, hit the correct key to open up your BIOS settings. Now navigate around your BIOS until you find the option to enable Wake on LAN. There are a whole lot of places this may be on different computers, so you may have to consult Google if you can't find where the option is. If you are completely stuck, leave me a comment below. After you enable this option, press the key that your BIOS will often show you to save and restart, and go ahead and restart your computer. Once you switch your computer on, you will have to allow your Ethernet port to actually wake up your computer. To do this, search for Device Manager, then head down to your network adapters, and look for the Ethernet device and double click on it. Next, head to power management and allow your device to wake up the computer. And check the magic packet box. After you do that, head to the advanced tab and make sure that the wake on magic packet option is on. After you have finished this part, press OK. Now we will need to set up a static IP address so the IP address that we will assign to the wake on LAN app will not change. Firstly, before we assign the address, go to search and type in CMD. When the command prompt window opens, type in ipconfig-all and press enter. Now keep this window open as we will be using it later and head to search again and type in ncpa.cpl, then hit enter. This should open up network connections. From here, right click on your ethernet device and click on properties. Now head down the list until you get to the internet protocol version 4 settings. Double click on that option now check the use the following IP address option. We will find the options to type in over in the command prompt window. Look for the area in the list underneath the ethernet adapter local area connection. While here take the IPv4 address, the subnet mask and the default gateway and type them into the corresponding boxes in control panel. After you've done that press ok but keep the IP address in mind or the command prompt window open because we'll need to input its value into our phone. Talking about your phone, let's head over there now. We have finally finished setting up your computer. Now I'm pretty sure that your apps would have downloaded. The first one that you want to open is the Wake on LAN app. While here, tap the add new button. For the name, put whatever you want. Now for your Mac address, sorry, but you will have to head back to your computer and open up your command prompt window. You should see the physical address. Type this address into the Mac address section. Leave the secure on box as it is for the IP address box, type in the IP address you used before. Leave your part as 9 and press save. Now exit this app and head over to Tasker. While here, head to the tasks tab. Now press on the plus button to the bottom right and input any name you want. Now tap on the central plus button at the bottom, go to plugin and tap on the WOL button. Here just tap on the pencil icon next to configuration and tap on the name of the Wake Online settings that you want to set up. Now press the back button at the top and press the same back button again. Now it's actually time to assign this tag to your NFC tag. Head out of the app and go to trigger. Press the plus button on the top right and press the plus button again. Tap on NFC and press next. If you want to add these restrictions, add them and then press done. Now press next again and now the plus again. Scroll down to tasker, tap the tasker task then next. Now press the magnifying glass, then the task that you just made and add it to the task and tap next then done. Now tap your phone to the NFC tag. If this doesn't work your NFC settings are likely off. They can be found in settings and more under wireless and networks. If the NFC settings aren't here for you, leave a comment down below and I'll help you find them. After you make a successful connection with the NFC tag it is all ready to go. Just as a quick note, every version of Windows except Windows 8 can switch on from shutdown. For you Windows 8 users, I would recommend using Hibernate to switch off your computer, as Wake on LAN works with hibernation. 
If you don't know how to enable hibernation on Windows 8, stay tuned to this channel as that should be the topic of my next video. Also bear in mind if you don't have an NFC tag candy, simply tap in your settings name in the Wake Online app will also wake up your computer. If you have any questions leave them down below and thank you for watching. Thank you.